Hello, my name is Sean Taylor, and I am a web development engineer with Amazon QuickSight. The feature that I will be showcasing today for you is Dynamic Titles. Amazon QuickSight is a scalable, serverless, embeddable, ML-powered BI service built for the cloud that you can use to deliver easy-to-understand insights to the people who you work with wherever they are. Dynamic Titles is a brand new feature to allow the author to add parameters to areas such as visual titles, subtitle, X and Y axis, legend, sheet tabs, sheet title, and description. With this, you can use the parameter values to help showcase to your reader key details about the visual. The parameters can also be connected to the control titles to allow for that data to be displayed within the visual. As the parameters value changes, so will your title. The reader will be able to gather more insights into the visual they are looking at. Now, let's take a look at how we can create these dynamic titles. First, I would like to show how dynamic titles work. In this dashboard, you can see that I have multiple controls and visuals. All of my visuals are reliant on the values of these controls, which are also parameters. You can see that as I change the dimension from hospital to region, that my visuals also change. You will notice that my title changed accordingly as well. This is because I am using parameters to create my dynamic title. Next, I will be showing how to create a parameter to be used as part of a dynamic title. So first off, we want to start by creating our parameter. For this case, I will be using hospital, and I want it to be a multiple value one, with our default being the downtown hospital. We'll go ahead and create this. And from here, I want to add a filter to our parameter. We'll go ahead and select, make sure the visual you want is selected. And again, we want to be using hospital. We'll go ahead and edit. And we, since we want it to be a custom filter, let's select that. We also want to use parameters, so we will select yes as well. And from our parameters list, let's go ahead and select hospital, which we just created, and we'll hit apply. We will now go back to our parameters, and we want to add a control for our hospital. We'll name, we'll name it hospital again, and we want to link it to our data set. From here, now our visual is controlled by this control up top. So every time we change our control, our visual will reflect it. Now, since our visual is dynamic, let's make our title dynamic as well. Let's go ahead and click our format visual over here. And in our title, let's replace hospital with our parameter hospital. So now anytime our control is edited, we can see that our title is also reflective of whatever it has been selected. Visual titles are not the only place that can be dynamic. Within a dashboard, its sheet tab, title, description, and control titles can all be made dynamic. Within the visual, the title, subtitle, X and Y axis, legend, and table column and row titles are also dynamic. When you are in the format visual pane, anytime you see this triple dots means that it's the drop down to allow you to add parameters. You will also see this drop down within the sheet tabs as well as on the right hand side for the sheet title and description. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed learning about dynamic titles with Amazon QuickSight.